welcome to another weekend vlog. Today I'm actually going to get a piercing. I'm just getting a helix, which is a cartilage piercing right here. I really, really wanted to get an industrial done, but I think I'm too much of a wimp because with an industrial, which is like the bar that goes through there, you need to do, they need to pierce it twice, like up here and then down here. And then because it's a bar, I feel like it's going to get caught in my hair and like get knocked around heaps. And seeing as I've never gotten a cartilage, oh, I've got like a tragus piercing here, but... I've never had a cartilage piercing like right um, around the tip of my ear so I think I'll start off with the helix first and then if that heals fine um, then maybe I'll get an industrial on this side of my ear left right yep and yeah so I'll try and vlog it for you I'm not actually sure whether I can film in the piercing place but last time I did like snapchat so hopefully it'll be fine So hopefully you guys can hear me, but I thought I'd talk you guys through my outfit again like I did last time. Is there another goddamn plane? <laughs> yeah. I have um, worn a beret for the first time today because I want to be really cool and like artsy-fartsy. But the thing is I really wanted the red beret and I couldn't find one so this black one will have to do. Yudita, who is behind the camera, did uh, want to lend me her one but it was like blue brown shit colour so... It's not! <laughs> it's not! Yeah, so I'll just go with the black one. And then I am... Uh, these glasses are from ASOS. And then my shirt is from, god damn it, I can't remember the name, it's like, I'll link it down below. And then my cardigan is also from ASOS, and it's this chunky cardigan I just got, and it's pretty much like a grandma cardigan. Comfy. And then my Gucci belt, and then my jeans are just the Farley jeans from ASOS that I've had for ages, but um, I don't know whether, does this mean my legs are short or what? Because the knees are like not at my knees, the knee ribs. But like the length is fine. I think it's, it just means that I have like short, like that part is yeah. short and this part is okay. And then oh, my shoes are the most exciting bit because I was talking about it before but they're the Gucci loafers. Okay, so Emily's finally awake as you can see and then I thought I'd tell, um, I'd get her to tell you guys about the piercing she's getting just in case any of you guys were wanting a, uh, oh you can hear Fisher barking outside. <laughs> Um, we're not torturing him, promise. Um, she Okay, what are you getting today? I'm getting a microdermal on my collarbone. It goes, um, it's like a tiny little um, one jewel piercing that just like sits underneath the skin. So instead of like going through something, they have like a little plate that just sits into the skin. And it's going in here. And I'm wearing clothes, don't worry. <laughs> You're going like in underneath the collarbone there. And you've already got dermals, right? So you know. Um, I've got surface piercings. Yeah. So they're different because um, actually, I've got. Yeah. I don't know if you can see it. That one there, and it's like while the that one there. Yeah. I got one on the back of my neck as well. But those ones, um, they have like a bar that sits under. So it's like a square bracket bar that sits under the skin. So there's two of them. While the microderm was just the one. So it just uh, like slides in. It's like. It's like it's like an L bar, it just like slides and sits in and then okay. you can screw the top yeah. one on. Yeah, okay, we'll see if we can film it. Um, if not, then I'll be sure to film afterwards and see if it's like all <laughs> gross and... Yeah, <laughs> it will be. <laughs> That's okay. Okay, catch you guys in a bit. Bye! Hi, you. <laughs> What's this foot doing? What's this foot doing? <laughs> Did you see him again? We almost got harassed by a homeless guy. It's fine. What? Huh? what? I no, think I, did I miss something? No, that guy, that homeless guy, um, you said I swerved across the road. You did. Yeah, yeah, but it was just like, you know, <laughs> what else was I meant to do? That's very <laughs> Um, We're off to find some lunch now. And I think we're going to the plane. You've never been to the one that, um... No. Huh? You see like the, the, the dude before? What? what? He was like, like, like that. And then the girl behind, behind he was like, yeah, I'm pulling like... <laughs> oh, shit! Okay, basically some guy tripped over in front of us and Yun um, swore in Indonesian and then but it yeah. turned... Yeah, but it turns out that that guy was Indonesian. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> 
she's there. What's Winky doing? Winky! Caught on camera. She was taking a photo of Tom Hardy. There. Wait. I can't aim. Where is it? Yeah, there's Tom Hardy here. Does he look like a tree? We just left Winky behind because she's still taking photos. She's like way over there. Hi, Emily. Hi, Emily. <laughs> What are you guys getting? Um, chili sin carne. Oh yeah, that was I really like that. I really yeah. Liked that last yeah. <laughs> oh, by the way, back with Holly and Summer again from the last the Winter Wonderland vlog. That's right. So they have decided. Wait, have you decided what pizza you're gonna get? Uh, I've decided, but I haven't chosen which one I'm gonna do today. I've got two choices. So. That's kind of like halfway. Yeah, I've mean, not really I decided. And you haven't decided at all. No. Okay. Now, wish us luck. <laughs> uh, we've stumbled upon this like Britain's Got Talent. I don't know if it's auditions or if it's like they're doing the competition round or what, but Emily said she's actually going to. Yeah, I'm gonna go in there and just start screaming because that's my talent. Nice. Okay, I'm in Topshop now because the piercers are actually inside Topshop. Okay, this is happening. I filled in my form. Okay. <laughs> 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 
This one here is coming quite sort of like out of the top, is that how you would like it? Um, I'd like the, yeah, because I'd like to change it to a hoop one day, so it's maybe something like this. So I'll pierce sort of coming, because usually you go sort of through straight that way, do you know what I mean? You turn it into a ring later. Yeah, yeah, okay. And you like it in these kind of positions on that sort of top edge? Yeah. Yeah, okay. That's Thanks. cool. Process, okay. You know. Okay, so nice and still, this is very quick, this one. Come on, let's take a deep breath for me. Just like that, so you can see the ball at the bottom of the moon. Looks nice, yeah. and then a little bit of snake with the top. Have a look. Thank you. It's even nice like that. But like I said, for the um, antibacterial thing at the. Yeah, did you want to get one from us? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Cool. at all so no, guys it but I thought you weren't allowed to use a gun for cartilage piercing. I thought I saw it. Yeah, but apparently in France. Well, it's not good about rules. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Who's next? Oh, wait, I'll come in. Yeah. No, you should. No, you have to come in. You have to come in. What a crap sister. <laughs> It's on fire right now. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's okay, not No one near as bad as it was last time. Yeah. It's like gun. microdermal so I'll get us to give you like a rundown of what happened once we get home and you can hear more but yeah it literally made me pretty squeamish and I wasn't even the one getting the piercing so <laughs> yeah. it didn't hurt though it was just like a big thing yeah yeah I know yeah. you you seem like you Maybe your I'm face just, like, like didn't change at all it was like, <laughs> I was like disassociating yeah like, I was not there yeah Just bump 
to Daisy Ridley and the Alden guy. I'm sorry, I don't know how to say his last name, but he's playing Han Solo, the young Han Solo in the new film. <laughs> yeah, Almond. <laughs> Almond. <laughs> and um, yeah, I don't know. Are they dating? Because they were walking together and they didn't want to be photographed. So I don't know. If they are, then we have the scoop. <laughs> Um, yeah, kind of. That's why I have to stand here. <laughs> no, it's like yellow. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay, so we're back home now. I thought I'd give you guys a little update on my piercing. So I did get the Helix piercing, as you can see. And I did ask the piercer because I want to get it changed to a hoop later on. So that's why he's pierced it at that angle. And um, the initial piercing itself was quite painful, actually. But I do have quite a high pain threshold, I think, anyway. So um, I just grinned and grinned and bared it. What's the past tense of bear? Bore. I grinned and bore it, basically. Bore. Is that right? Yeah. yeah. A bear or bore? Bear? Bore? bore? Whatever. You know what I mean, okay? <laughs> um, yeah. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, and it was burning and throbbing quite a bit beforehand, but now it's kind of okay, I think. I do spot a bit of blood there, so sorry if you're squeamish, but I will clean it up. And then I did get the little like saline um, antibacterial spray that they get uh, that they gave us. And um, oh, I did want to. I wasn't allowed to film Emily's piercing. I'm not sure if it was because of that particular piercer or if it, it was because it's a microdermal piercing. But I thought I'd get her to like um, fill you guys in on what happened and stuff because I was in the room with her and I was watching it, and it was kind of. Uh, Gory to say the least. <laughs> you know more about it than I do because I couldn't see it like happening. Oh yeah, that's so, true. Like, you actually watched. That's it. true, but I don't know what they actually did. So basically, um, they got Emily to lie down, and it's right there. So they marked the spot where they wanted the um, dermal to go, mm. and then I don't know. So do they insert a disc first? Um, they like. From what I've read, they cut a hole in you, yeah, and then kind of like yeah, insert the disc underneath yeah. the skin, and then like kind of poke it. Yeah, because like I don't know what the hole, but I did see them on. like punch something through, right? And then they probably inserted the disc because I saw them like with the metal thing like mm. fiddling through, and you could actually see the hole. Like it was a pretty big hole. Like yeah. literally, they were stabbing like into the hole in her shoulder, and I was yeah. just like, okay. I have to keep it covered for like a week, otherwise it might just fall out. Keep yeah, the hole's like still open. Yeah, it's pretty so. big, and then they screwed the crystal on top yeah. of it. Yeah, yeah. And it's like a, a round plate thing with the screw top. And yeah. was it painful? Um, it stung like a bee, like it was just like a bee sting, mm -hmm. and but it wasn't like painful or anything. It just, it definitely wasn't the most painful one I've ever got. Okay, because yeah, um, I was um, I was watching Emily getting it done, and then her expression didn't even change. Like she didn't even flinch. So I was like, okay, cool. I couldn't even look like the whole way, <laughs> the whole time. I was just like, I was like watching you at the corner of my eye because I was like focused yeah. on the roof. Because like that's a trick. Just kind of like focus on something and just do not take your eyes yeah. off that thing just focus yeah. on it and then it just you don't I had to like grab my it. arm yeah and just like squeeze it yeah, yeah. but yeah, yeah it, it, was, it wasn't as painful as I was expecting it to be okay yeah that's like, good oh, okay so I think the aftercare they asked to put a bandage over it yeah but you do have to air it too yeah I gotta I'll take it off maybe two or three times a day um just to like spray it because I've got aftercare spray, like salt spray. Mm -hmm. So I'll do that for like a week and then I'll take the bandage off for a couple of days and see how it goes. Hopefully it will stay in because yeah. like collarbones and um, chest have like a high rate of rejection. Especially because there's a lot of movement in the joint because it's like it's kind of up in the joint now. So hopefully it'll stay in, but we'll see how it goes. Yeah. If it falls out, I'll just wait for it to heal and then get it done again. Okay, yes, yeah, so that's, <laughs> that's the way to go about things. Yeah. Until it just stays, I'll be like, no, you stay there. <coughs> stay there. <laughs> yeah, okay. so yeah, we've all got our piercings done. Yeah. And it went well. Emily's off now, bye. Bye. <laughs> bye. <laughs> what is going on here? Oh, no. Excuse me? Uh, what? This is pornographic. Oh. I've also just come home to Oscars rehearsal pics. Oh my god. You completely forgot about the Oscars. Yeah. Well, I've been waiting like my entire life to see this. But look, looks like they're going to be presenting together. Computer-generated effect. Or as I like to call it, the uh, we don't 
the next day now and today we're off to well this morning we're off to Burberry Makers House which is um, where they did the Burberry show at um, London Fashion Week and they basically open I think this is what it is because I've never actually been there before but they open up the venue and then they showcase like the latest um, seasons clothes and stuff so um, today's the last day it's gonna be open so we're gonna check that out <laughs> beautiful things at Burberry Maker's house and especially all these cakes. They are stunning. This might be my favorite one. The one with the hood. Winky's calling it the Ezio cake. Okay, which one's your favorite? This one? Gem one? That's a knit thing that Kendall Jenner wore to that party. I don't even know, but I just know that Kendall wore it. <laughs> now we're at a sushi train place for lunch and I'm just going to end the vlog here since it's raining outside and we're not doing much anymore so thanks so much for watching guys I hope you enjoyed this little weekend vlog um, be sure to subscribe to my channel if you're new and you want to see more videos from me and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and I'll see you guys in my next one bye bye, bye. bye.